What's going on guys, Cypher CX here bringing you another Elden Ring video and we are going against the Crucible Knight. Gonna be learning how to parry him. These types of moves, you need the dodge out of the way, heavy attacks, the stomp, something like this, that double swing, something you need to watch out for. This parryable attack, you'll see you'll get the critical on him. Gonna back off here. You gotta wait for those attacks, you gotta be patient. This, you gotta dodge, he usually does a weak attack, yep, right here you can parry, get the other critical. But it's all about taking a look, seeing what move he's about to use, his hand movements, everything. That one, parry, go. Usually after the stomp, during the beginning phases, it's going to be a weak attack that you could parry. But, up, oh, I tried to parry that, it was a stab, can't parry that, that's an unparryable move. Those are heavy attacks, you gotta dodge this, double dodge. Into, oh, he went Super Saiyan. You gotta dodge this. And over here, parry again. As you can see, when he's coming down, it's a weak attack. Get the parry on him. That I missed the stomp, and I actually got past the tail swipe. Tail swipe's usually my worst. Got the parry afterwards, getting him down. But this guy, he's completely parryable. He's probably one of the easier bosses to parry now that I've learned how to do it. Not even boss, but enemy type. I get hit by the tail swipe here again. This, not parryable. That's parryable, but I dodged. Not parryable, not parryable. Gotta dodge past this, because it's a pokey poke. I get stuck here, camera angle suck. Get hit. Dodge out of the tail swipe. Gotta dodge out of this. But it's all about patience, knowing when to dodge, and knowing when to parry, what attacks you could parry. Gotta dodge out of this. Trying it past this tail swipe. Nope. Gotta dodge past this type of attack. Dodge past that. Over here, gonna get that parry. Critical. Got one more. Right there, the last one. It's all about patience. Patience is key in this fight. You wanna wait for those simple attacks, the weak attacks, the ones that are parryable, and you wanna keep an eye out for the ones that you could dodge. Anyway, that's how you beat the Crucible Knight in the Ever Ever Jail. Let me know how I did. Take care.